Hello everybody and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today is the second episode of Arizona. Still in Arizona, will be for a while. Uh, so yeah, this is the second video. We're doing a lot of black lighting. We're going to do a little bit of herping, a little bit of finding of other insects and stuff. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy this episode. Alright, anyways, let it begin. Ourselves an active colony of Xerophila. Hoping they fly. You see all their majors and stuff. Really just bubbling out of there. Oh, a late too. Would you look at that? Cool. Alright, let's keep looking. Look at this huge moth. Came to our black light. I have no idea what species it is, but it is huge. Wow. Look at bro. So we're out here black lighting. Trying to disturb it, but we got a bunch of Fidole males, and we've gotten quite a few queens actually, including uh, what we have here, which is an obtuso spinosa queen. This is one of the trimorphic Fidole species, one of the more common ones. So cool. Hopefully, I can get her to have workers, but they kind of suck at founding, so you know. Hopefully. They're pros at founding. Are they? Oh no, it's that they, they like die really easily with uh, nanetics now. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Besides for this, alongside that we also have a ton of xerophila here. These guys are really pretty. I really want to get a colony of these guys too. Beautiful. We're going to start wandering for the uh, Obtuso spinosa and also for the Xerophila as well. Alongside a smaller ant species, or smaller fiddly species, which we aren't sure uh, what they are. So Here we have a, uh, the tiny fiddly species that I was talking about. I found a Deolate. No idea what she is, though. <clears throat> kind of cute, but... Yeah. Interesting. Don't know what she is. Got ourselves Rhea. Fiduli Rhea, my favorite species in my house, just chilling out here in the desert. Don't know what they're doing though. Or where they're coming from. Clearly they have places to be. Got ourselves an Odontomachus trap giant. Haven't seen these guys in a while since I last tried to raise them and then immediately they died. Cool. Perhaps we can catch a queen or two of these. Doubtful, but perhaps. Here we have a Neva Myrmex. Little army ant guys. Kinda moving around, trailing, doing their thing, as always. Never seen these guys before. These are real neat. Dude's probably going over to raid some poor ant colony, probably. <laughs> awesome. Very pretty. Oh, I would like to focus. Feed a lake queen here. Teeny tiny guy, but looks real nice. Don't know what it is though. It's like the size of like fiddly navigans. It's crazy. <laughs> it's picking up well on video, but there is a huge swarm of just Ferelius. Oh, it's being picked up on video. Nice. Massive swarm. A decent number of relics. There's one right in front of us right here. Oh. Got ourselves a huge Nova Messer colony here. Look how deep that hole is. See there's a late that's coming out. It's cool. Another nest over here. Huge colony. We've been able to uh, find a flight also of Nova Messer. Look at all those queens. 
pretty awesome. I've never seen them fly or really large colonies. So yeah, that's awesome. So cool. So huge too. Some Solenopsis thief ants right here. Big old flight. Right from the colony. We just got like over two inches of rain. Flash flood warning still on us, I believe. But they're going. This huge beetle. Oh my lord. That's so cool. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Oh, he's a, he's gone. Bye bye, visitor. Got tons of Solenopsis males out here. Tons of queens as well, but mostly males right now. Everywhere. And then, oh, where'd she go? Uh, oh, we lost her. But there was an obtuso spinosum. Uh,. Major just walking around earlier. Yeah, she's gone. Yeah, it's insane. Where's she? Oh, there she is. Obtuso Spinosa. In the pile of males. <laughs> Look at all these queens we got. All Solenopsis thief ants. Insane. This isn't the only tube either. We have uh, two containers full. Pretty impressive. <coughs> wow. Got ourselves an obtuso spinosa colony here. They're currently flying. Queens over here. Above me is just this massive swarm of them. So cool. Those acro workers just kind of walking around here, hoping they fly. Yeah, awesome. Deuce are going absolutely crazy. Got quite a few queens now. Ophidia obtuso spinosa. <clears throat> Trimorphic guys. Was it called a Tepicana queen? A Fidelae Tepicana, another trimorphic species. A Fidelae. Yeah. Awesome. Really is flying. I mean, like, hardcore flying. Like, huge. Spread over onto this rock. This rock. This rock. This rock. Crazy. It was an Acro Myrmex Queen. Look at that. We're a little late to catch the swarms, but we're hoping to catch some queens like this one here. We will catch multiple. Alrighty, so we got all these queens tubed, right? We got all those queens tubed, right? How many do you think we still have to do? Well, we have this entire container here. We got this whole container here, and this, and then, isn't there another one? No. Oh, okay. So, all of these. Oh, and these. I don't want to, I don't want a tube anymore. <laughs> but we have to. Uh, it's sad. So there's a rattlesnake under here. T-Bone's behind the camera. Say hi. What's up? Alright. So, uh, this is kind of stressful. If I lift this up, it's just right over there. There she is. Oh, she's big. Yeah, looks like it's a diamond back. She's going underneath okay. toward you, kind I of. Can't move this then. She's coming through you. Yeah. Uh, I'll just move back then. Oh, she stopped. She stopped. I don't know if that's a diamond back. No, no, that ain't no di diamond back. That's something else. Should I zoom in? Yeah, yeah. Why not? Let me find a stick. Oh, dude, I don't know if we should play with it anymore. <laughs> Doesn't seem very happy. <laughs> he 
He called it too. He found the log. He's like, I wonder if there's a rattlesnake under this log. And then there was. Alright, I got a big old stick. <laughs> He's got a big old stick. Look at this guy. <laughs> All right. Ooh. You're okay. He doesn't want to smush you. That's the main thing. I know. Angry. How are you moving? Angry. Don't Angry. Look under. Come on. Oof. That's a really bad spot for her to be in. Yeah, I'll move. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to get her. Come on, get out. Get out. Keep moving. Where is she? She's on the other side of the log. Okay, well, she doesn't want to move. She's in a safe place now anyways, but... That just means we can't put the log back, really. Yeah. That well, we're just uh, waiting for Barbados. I've been flipping for snakes. And then all of a sudden, we have this here, a uh, scorpion. I think it's either a fat tail or, uh, what's the other one? A bark scorpion. I'm not sure, though, but I will be collecting it. I mean, getting it properly ID'd by some folks. Awesome! We got ourselves another scorpion. Same species as the other one. However, I haven't flipped this one yet. So, that's flip this one. Hope that there isn't uh, not much. Not even another scorpion. I right hear. Nope. Here we have this really tiny little Ridley species. I forget what species name it is. Rugulosa. It's Rugulosa. Thank you, T-Bone. But uh, yeah. Pretty dang Small. Well, I would say cool, but they don't really look that cool. <laughs> They're just little tiny guys. <laughs> Better sell a Mexicanus colony. Or consistence Mexicanus. Just kind of chilling at their entrance, so it's not doing much. At all. Uh, I haven't seen the species yet, so it's kind of cool. Like really big things. Or nest entrances. Well, the rocks. Looks pretty cool. Here we got a uh, rainbow grasshopper. I've never seen one of these before. They're absolutely beautiful. Plus there's like other ants over here, but mainly these guys. Look at that. Silva. So, uh, some type of <laughs> tarantula. I was just told it. It's an Afonopelma. Afonopelma, there we go. Did you look at that. It's a male. Dude is just kind of... He's just kind of... Right? Huge, just yeah. black light. One thousand percented Navajo. Oh, what? What the? Server? What is this? That's a small oh, moth. Get out of my Cape and Otis container. <laughs> yeah, that's mm. a uh, Carolina Sphinx. Wow. You got a Navajo. I'm not feeding those. Navajo plastics. queen. Another one? Oh, just kind of chilling. No, I'm recording <laughs> the smaller one. Or this one over here. <laughs> this moth is just messing oh, with us constantly. This man. guy is pretty. Oh, a tarantula. What? Oh, Mario, you already done got one. Oh, right? yeah, I do. It's cute. I wonder if it could be a dwarf. On an expedition. What will we find? They know it's up. <laughs> they getting raided. I don't think they're on guard. I think they're Their scared. queen might be a. Uh... <laughs> Their queen might be out. Perhaps. Can you might be a oot in a boot. No, I don't think that they've evacuated enough, but I think that... that's cool. I saw a camp. Look small. at this. Trust These well, Neva Mermex are going it. crazy. Do they move like at the same time as them raiding? No. no. Fuck. Sorry. Raiding Man, behavior that's crazy. and moving behavior. Made it back to the black light. Oh! oh. Nice. Oh. Yes. What'd you find? A female one. That guy's been here since. Uh, is it? No, it's Yo. male. Look at yeah. his claspers. What is that thing? It's a royal splendid moth. This is like my favorite fucking moth species. That is so pretty. Nice, bro. And that's early. Too. Man. That's beautiful. This one is really red, but I... Look at these nerds obsess obsessing over this moth. Oh. Looking sick ass moth. It is. There you go. <laughs> Black light's slowing down, though. That's like a big moth. It is pretty big. Got a few queens, though. What the... What this guy is, but he's chromato. Dude's chilling. Look at this. 
these Pogonomermex barbatus got a large beetle. They're just kind of eating it like they do. That's crazy though. I'm expecting them to get this, let alone be active in this late. Got ourselves a Colobopsis queen. Mason caught. Or, sorry, yeah. T Bone here caught it. <laughs> But Mason is the proud owner of Mr. Doctor Stateside Ants. <laughs> Mr. Doctor Stateside Ants. Mr. Doctor. Didn't know you had a doctorate. I don't want to take um, wide angles of like you holding them or something. That'd be cool. That could be cool. But you should get some good macro of them too. Here are some of the queens we caught uh, during the black lighting with Arthropod Antics and you know everybody else. Uh, <laughs> And right here is the first queen here. It's Fidelic Queen. It's uh, Fidelis Rosia, I believe is how you pronounce it. Small, small little guy. Very pretty. Uh, pretty neat, to say the least. Uh, next up is Campanada's Vafer Queen. We caught uh, a few of these as well. Uh, kind of a more boring species of Campanadas, but they're still really pretty. And I uh, really do hope to get a... Nice colony of these guys going. Uh, honestly, not really that interesting, but it was one of the species that was just constantly appearing at the black light. And the other one is a little bit more rare and is a species I'm incredibly excited about catching. This here is a Myrmecocystis Navajo Queen. I was able to catch one. Uh, I accidentally killed another, which made me quite upset, and the other's a little bit upset. Um, <laughs> however, would you look at that? It's Navajo. These guys are awesome, and uh, we managed to get a few come to the black light. I got one, and I think the others got some as well. But uh, yeah, absolutely awesome ant species, and I'm really, really stoked to have gotten a queen of these. And that is it for this vlog. I want to thank uh, Arthpod Antics and Easy Macro Guy or Mason uh, for inviting us out to go black lighting. That was a lot of fun. And uh, gave me a lot of content, so you know, that's that's really helpful. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like the video if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it. Subscribe if you're new. Check out all of the links in the description, the Discord, the Patreon, the Instagram, the everything. And I'll talk to you all in the next video. Goodbye.